Hello, my Ravens. I'm about to make history on my my YouTube channel, at least personal history, because today I have my very first video game review. You've heard me talk about in other videos how I like video games. I just haven't did that much lately. I haven't had the time or the money. But uh, um, growing up, I was always a fan of the Final Fantasy games. Part 9 being my personal favorite, but I remember the original ones on Super Nintendo. Part 2 and Part 3, or they were different numbers because it was different in Japan or something like that, but I knew them as 2 and 3. I read Part 2 and I loved it. Me and my stepdad would play them constantly. We'd rent them and keep them for like two weeks, and by the time we paid our late fees, we could have bought the darn things. But uh, they were always uh, some of my favorite games growing up, and then as they got um, older, uh, as they got advanced more, they uh, advanced how many RPG games have and changed the system a lot, and uh, I'm not too f fond of the whole uh, real-time battle thing. I'm more of a fan of the slow-paced, uh, turn-based uh, battle system. But now let's bring me to uh, the game I'm reviewing. World of Final Fantasy. I I thought it looked kind of good, and it kind of like it seems like so far like it's gonna like uh, kind of be like a tribute to all the games, you know, kind of connect every single one of them. And so far, I love it. It it it's a very big throwback and very nostalgic so far, and it's full of uh, a ton of tons of goofy humor. But of course, I like that. Look who you're talking to. But um. Uh, so far, I, I would call it a, a Final Fantasy version of Pokemon because there's a lot in it that has a lot of the same aspects as Pokemon because you're catching these mirages and everything, and uh, it's a it's a kind of you know similar to the same system except you wear them on your head or something like that, and you have to stack them as it's called, you know, without going into the whole game details. I'm sure you can look this up, but um. Like, I'm not saying it's a Pokemon ripoff, but it, it's kind of, it has a lot of the same uh, mechanics as it, you know, because you have to catch these mirages and, uh, and these ball spear-like things, and, uh, but it's fun so far, I love it, I mean, it's great. And uh, the, the battles are like, you can do, you can have like the fast time, fast paced battles, or you can do it the slow time, which turns out to be like turn-based. And I like it. It's just a throwback to the original. I mean, it makes me feel like I'm playing like uh, uh, the older games back on uh, PlayStation. Well, of course, this is on PlayStation, but you get what I'm talking about. Because uh, uh, you have very realistic-looking characters, and uh, and uh, you have uh, a bunch of cute little creatures. I'm here that to talk about the world of the Final Fantasy. I'm sure the, you'll enjoy the, this video. Okay, I promise I'll stop. I'll stop talking about it like that. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, the, the creatures are great. Uh, the graphics are great. And I love the system to it so far. And I think I'm like on chapter four, so I think I'm only just like a very short ways into it. And from the looks of it, there is a lot to do. And I'm thrilled. I hope this game goes on for a long, long time. And, uh, uh, I wish other RPG games would start coming out and doing this throwback because a lot of us love the old turn-based systems and everything. I wish some more video games would come out like that. Uh, more like uh, the way uh, the old Breath of Fires and uh, and um, Final Fantasies and uh, even the Sukadens. Oh yeah, I loved how the you know I love the Sukaden game. I I think I'm saying that right. Sukaden, Suikaden, I don't know. But anyway, I think you know what I'm talking about. The one where you get, like, a castle and you have, like, over 100 people to choose from and everything. But I am very happy with this purchase. It was well worth my money. Better than another wrestling game I bought recently. I'll leave unnamed. But, uh, uh, I don't know if I'll do many more reviews. If I come up with a really good game that I like, I will review it. No, you know, I've reviewed books, or Buster's reviewed books, and, uh... And, um, I think the video games are the only thing I have reviewed, anyway. But, that, uh, that's, uh, my review for, uh, World of Final Fantasy, and I don't really have a 
rating to give. I guess if I if I had to say, I'd say five out of five stars because I love it so far, and I hope it goes on for a while, and I hope they make uh, sequels to it. But uh, uh, that was just a little change up for here. No um, no book pitching today. I just wanted to tell you what I thought about this game, and if you are a Final Fantasy fan, you've got to get this game because you will love it. I think. Um, so, uh, not really much else to say, but, uh, like this video, uh, subscribe to my channel, and like I always say, well, in this case, it's happy gaming, but happy reading.